guys welcome back to my channel it's been so long since I posted any videos on YouTube I decided that I wanted to get back into it so I'm gonna start with doing a much awaited home office reveal tour for you guys so this is something that I've been wanting to do for like pretty much the last year since I moved to California and like redesigned my entire room so now I finally have everything done and ready and of course I'm always changing like a little bit here and there just because I love um, like decorating anything so this is a room that I had thought about for the longest time I had so many Pinterest boards that I created to like get inspiration for it um, but then I just kind of like came up with my own ideas and mixed it with Pinterest a little bit so that's the creation you're gonna see today so let's get into it okay so I'm gonna start off by showing you guys my favorite part of the office that being the desk where all of my work gets done um, I kind of want to like go through what my inspiration was as well and like the thought process behind my desk um, and the whole room of course um, everything as you can see is pink white and gold probably my most three favorite colors and um, they're colors I had in my old home office as well before I moved but um, I wanted more of like a like tropical maybe I keep calling it modern bohemian chic I live in San Diego now and everything is like tropical all the time um, I wanted something that had like sort of like a um, a pop of color which the green does as you can tell so I added some accents along with the white because otherwise it would be like too bright and like too plain so I got this cute little thing at um, Target this plant has been alive since like the last year so I'm doing something right. <laughs> um, I have more plants over here too. And these came from a local store called Pigment. It's a great San Diego shop but love it. So basically I wanted to have a space where I felt like motivated and clean and like work efficient and like I wouldn't get distracted. And I know that a lot of like dark colors for me make me feel like not motivated and distracted so didn't want to do that but i have a lot of storage space ignore the wires down there i can't make that look any prettier but <laughs> i wanted a lot of storage space so i went with like the ikea um alex drawers it came with a linman tabletop desk i believe this is the 72 inch and then a lot of my most of my desk accessories come from target so this was from target i think i linked a similar one for you guys because this one wasn't available anymore stapler and tape dispenser both came from target as well the frames it's my fiance so excited this came from target i'm linking the wall prints pretty much everything in here is linked and if it's not comment below and i'll try to find it for you guys love my laptop case i actually got this from case app um they have like really cute prints and like different decals for your iphones and your um macbooks it's pretty cool this also came from target these are cute they're also not available anymore so i'm linking like the um the gold pins push pins and like the paper clips and stuff because that's still available also target i swear target has like the best stuff like you can't go wrong everybody loves target this is my favorite mug where I fill it with tea every morning. This morning didn't happen, but it's my go-to. And then moving on, my favorite find for this room was this chair, which I got from Home Goods. So I've linked two similar chairs that I also absolutely love. If you go to Home Goods, you could probably find something similar. I don't know, which is hard to tell because Home Goods always has stuff that they change out daily like if you see something you have to buy because it it's going to be gone the next day and then i've linked the gold sequin pillows for you forgot to also mention that these prints were from etsy so um there's a different variety of them so you have like options but i really like this one because i think it looks the most i don't know perfect looking um like the coloring is perfect and i actually got them printed at FedEx store so that um, the quality would be good. I didn't have a printer that size anyway, so it didn't work out. But yeah, moving on, um, this is the kind of like the storage shelf area. Now, I'm actually thinking about switching this area up like very soon. I love it, but like I said before, I'm always switching things out like just because I always have some sort of like design inspiration and I like want to do something different. Um, 
but the shelf I got from Ikea. Um, they also have them on Amazon, so I'm gonna be linking that there, just because it's like so much easier if you don't have an Ikea near you. Like you can just have it shipped with Prime. I like to add like accents of pink, um, some books, and got pictures from Posh Fest two years ago. Actually, it's almost three years ago now. My friend Christina, hi Christina, and my best friend Nadine, that's from when we were in Austria. Um, and then I've got these cute little trinkets. This was from Valentine's Day from at Target like four years ago. So <laughs> I'll try to find another one for you guys, but I don't know if it's gonna be the same. These frames, they came from Target. They're the five by sevens. This cute little cactus was from Home Goods. Um, pineapple cookie jar, which I don't really put cookies in, but I kind of want to. That is from Target as well. It's still available. Got some accents, um, candles, and then um, a gold metal organizer from Target with my Posh Fest or Posh Party Live pictures. My best friend's in there. And then down here, I have some plants. It's an artificial plant, but that came from Home Goods Michael Kors bag. And then these guys are probably like my f my most favorite and first home office find like when i first started like creating a home office years ago they're the kate spade nesting boxes and i swear they are the prettiest things and the only problem is that like they've been out of stock for a while now i linked them for you but they probably won't be back in stock but you guys can keep checking um like people have said that over the years they've seen them at home goods randomly but you just never know, so I'm so glad I snagged them when I did because they're really great storage boxes for Poshmark and my other inventory as well. And then I wrapped everything with these pretty little fairy lights that are remote controlled. And yeah, so I'm gonna walk in this way just to show you guys how spacious everything is. We live in an apartment complex, so it's amazing that we have this much storage space as well. That was one of the things I was looking for when we first moved in because or like when we were deciding where we were gonna move to because I had so much inventory that I needed to put in this office. Um, and it's really important for my business to have that and like most places in the area just like didn't have it. As most of you know, like I run my Poshmark business full time from home as well as other things, but for Poshmark, I need lots of space. So I have this whole closet sliding door and then this side is also a sliding door um, that side's mostly for like like the storage we have for things in the house and all this is inventory and then I have another rack from Ikea which is so cute and it was so cheap it was only ten dollars um, so I keep a lot of the new inventory that I just got that I still have to take pictures of right here and then I can move it around if I want to and you know whatever I have to do with it and then I have more inventory room over here. This was from Ikea. Um, I'm linking everything. Right now it's fall, so I put all kinds of cute, like pink and white pumpkin stuff over here. Of course, because I'm in California, of course there's a cactus and other palm plants, which pretty much stay there year round. So um, my favorite, the last piece I added to this section was this round mirror, which this whole, side of the room is like a very trendy thing. I've seen it a lot on Pinterest. A lot of bloggers have been doing it just because it looks like so good, so well put together. You know, it can be like a little dresser area or you can just use it for whatever you want. But for me, it's like just a cute little area to like store things. And then I will a lot of times um, use the tabletop to package up my Poshmark packages and orders and take selfies sometimes in this mirror. But I'm thinking the background's a little bit like too, I don't know, there's too much going on in it to take pictures, but I still love it. So that's from Target. And then my favorite blogger hat is the Lack of Color hat, um, also linking for you guys. And then some of these things I got from Home Goods and local boutiques, but uh, just to show you real quick, I made these as part of my... Um, like I design, I do graphic design, but I made these to sell on Poshmark. So they're on my wholesale portal account, Twilight Gypsy Co. And also my um, 
my regular seller account, JenAngel89. I'll link those two. If you guys are on Poshmark, you can go check it out. I have plenty. They're pop sockets, by the way, if you can tell. But Posh is my bae. Yep, it's a very trendy thing. And then I wanted to show you my favorite rug. I also had this rug in Virginia before I moved, so that one stayed there. Um, it's a new loom rug, but I also found it on Rugs USA. I'll link both, I guess, if I can find it, but it's really, really soft. It's like gray and white geometric pattern, and I thought, well, there's not a lot of gray in here, but that was like always my favorite, like gray, white, pink, and gold, so anything I buy is gonna go towards that like aesthetic. So over so. here, What's really neat about this room is that it's like a second bedroom and bathroom. So I have like my whole own space. I, I don't have to like worry about leaving the room. I can just stay in here, get everything done, get ready in the morning, whatever I need. Um, so what's interesting is when we moved in, this whole tabletop as well as our like kitchen and other bathroom tabletops were totally black. And this wall that I painted pink was really like dark teal blue like the worst possible colors you could imagine so i did what i thought would be a great idea and that was to find um like a, a budget-friendly adhesive like cover-up so i spent like i swear it took two days to do this perfectly because i had to go like around the sink and cut all the pieces but this is the best thing you can do if you're renting is to find adhesive um like covers it's really great yeah, that's from Walmart, and it took about, like, I'd say two rolls for this whole sink, which is not that bad. They're about, like, $9 a roll. Um, but anyways, so <laughs> just to show you, I have this, which I got from uh, one of my favorite stores in Virginia called Altered State last year. There's so many beautiful dream catchers online that I'll link a couple that I really love for you. More pineapples, and then the famous letter board because it's currently pumpkin spice season. I like switching this out for whatever season it is. I had, for my birthday, I had 30 flirty and thriving on it. Um, but yeah, it's also reversible. So if you want to, you know, if you have like a farmhouse or like, you know, you have a different color in your office or wherever you want to put it, you can switch it out. Um, have a little like jewelry tray. And then one of my favorite things right now is this um, organizer for your hair accessories. So you can wrap your headbands around the outside, put scrunchies on top, and then you can, I don't have anything at the bottom right now, but you can put in like hair clips or even hair brushes, it's big enough for that. I've also linked that as well. And then moving over here, I actually used this, I did a little DIY thing, but I used this um, wine bottle. I don't even know, I guess like the, the brand name is called relax but i used it as a bracelet holder um and these are all bracelets i designed um they're on poshmark but it's like a great little area for that to put that in and then i have a metal basket pink of course and these cute little storage jars for cotton balls and things like that and then and this the lighting is bad but i'm going to show you kind of what i did in this bathroom um it's better if i turn it off no yes Yes, this wall and this whole bathroom was basically the same dark blue as in the other room and I decided I was going to paint it pink immediately and then I found these cool frames from Target and I made the whole thing kind of matching to my office um, and then I really love the shower curtain. So this I got from Zazzle which is great because they have so many like cute designs and it's polka dot and pink. And then I got the cute little hooks from Target. And then I also painted that pink. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoy my room tour. If you have any questions, um, you can comment below. And if you're new to the channel, I would love to have you subscribe. Just press the subscribe button down below. And let me know if you want to see more like room tour videos. I still have to like fix up other areas of the house first before we do that. But let me know what other kinds of videos you'd like to see and thanks again for watching. Bye!